Essentially, when it comes to a winter boot, if I'm walking in the snow and I'm gonna be hanging out, I look for how comfortable is my boot, number one. Number two, how easy can I get it on and off? Then it's a matter of like, now what's the snow doing? Do I just walk with my boots? Do I bring snowshoes in case it gets deep? Or do I go with a micro spike traction on the bottom of my boots, you know, which is a rubberized deal with a bunch of spikes on it. You just pull over your boot. Yeah. And so you got to determine how you're going to like, like how does the snow feel? A lot of people I'll see grab their snowshoes and start walking on an old summer dirt road that's kind of compacted with snow. You know, yeah. 500 people have walked on it and they got snowshoes and they're just tripping over their snowshoes the entire time. I would say that's like the majority of the time I see people using snowshoes where, like you said, like micro spikes, if the trail is that firm, like that makes way more sense. It's gonna use less energy and you're probably, hopefully not gonna trip as much.